Online purchases have already surpassed traditional bricks and mortar purchases and e-commerce is going to continue to grow, mobile commerce is going to continue to grow. And people often forget when they buy things online what's involved in moving the goods from the online retailer to whatever end destination it's headed to, a business or a, uh, or a consumer. And you've created Stephen Gogovan to solve this logistics nightmare for small to medium business and help people move goods on demand. On-demand businesses have really emerged in the sharing economy, but it's still a very difficult model to operate. Mm -hmm. but what's making GoGoVan so unique? I think what makes it so unique is um, the model that is not exist in the logistic industry before. It used to be all, all these companies buying their own vehicle or having a contract with logistic company to get all their logistic service confirmed. But a lot of things is out of your plan. For example, a lot of deliveries, if the flight is delayed for one day, and then what's going on? And then you tell your, your contractors, okay, I'm sorry, there's not enough goods today. I'm going to batch everything and deliver it tomorrow. It's, it's a waste of time and waste of cost. And then by building this sharing economy for logistics, actually we consolidate a lot of idle capacity, which is very similar to all these passengers' vehicles sitting around. They can just tap into this network, what we call the infrastructure of their business. You've got over 8 million drivers operating over 300 cities across China. You're, you're already at scale and growing rapidly mm -hmm. with the merger you did last year with 58.com. But there's a quality control issue you must have. How do you make sure the quality of the drivers, the quality of the delivery service is always there for your, your customers? So what we do is uh, offering them a very standardized training program. If you want to be a professional driver, get more, more work or job in the future, you have to join our training program and by that, you will become one of a better driver out of this big group. And then more and more customers and business are willing to talk to you because you have professional trainings, no matter what kind of background that you are from. So we created that in China and it has been working really well. You've moved the on-demand model now somewhat into a scheduled model where you're offering small to medium businesses mm -hmm. the opportunity to schedule freight using your platform, but it's the more traditional model, why is it advantageous for businesses to be able to schedule with Google Van versus purely on demand? Over the years, we find a lot of small medium enterprise that are willing to use on demand platform instead of owning their own vehicle. Because a lot of time, uh, for example, you don't want to pay for the parking for your van at night. If you are just hiring whenever you need, then you just pay for the, for the cost that you are using it. And then what's all this about insurance, maintenance, get oil change, and parking packing fee at night, and also hiring the drivers. You are not going to pay the insurance for the drivers for the for a whole year. You just pay for your trip, and then your good can be insured per trip. So things like that make it much more easy for a uh, small, medium enterprise to manage it. And then over the years, and then some businesses, they have consistent delivery. Then we also can take care of it because first of all, they're not buying their own vehicle. So some kind of scheduling problem they used to have their own vehicle, so their schedule is easier. But now, okay, something is on demand, something is scheduled, it makes it more complicated. But we said, we have the largest network in any single city that we are operating, so why don't you just tell me your schedule and then I fix whatever network, the capacity for you.